Good morning. It's Tuesday morning and I have been, I, I love it when I wake up in the morning or actually for several days and it's just pounding in my head what I should talk about. And today I woke up and the same thing. I was like, okay, here it goes. And it's about doing hard things. We have a saying in our family is you can do hard things. It doesn't matter what it is. You can do hard things. So I started thinking about some of the hardest things in life. And what's easy to do, and then what's hard. And one of those things, it's easy to blame somebody else. It's hard to take responsibility. It's easy to put our struggle, our challenges on somebody else. It's hard to accept them. It's easy to not forgive somebody. It's hard to forgive. It's easy to wake up in the morning and just stay in bed. It's hard to get up and to be determined and focus. It's easy to ignore people. It's hard to stay engaged and to be present. I was just an organ. And there is a lot of hard things. One of those things is I helped arrange my, clean up my father's garage and everything. And it, it was, it was a disaster. The organ, there was no organization. <coughs> I got there on a Tuesday and I worked on that garage from Wednesday all the way to the day I left. Literally the morning of the day I left. And it's easy to have left that mess and just say, you know what, I, it's better than where it was at. It's hard to complete it. But I did it. Now I'm not saying that to brag, but I want to talk about another thing. What I've noticed is the hardest things in life are to deal with those mental struggles, those mental challenges. Now it's hard to handle depression, anxiety. It's hard to manage addiction. It's I mean it's easy to give in to something. It's really easy. Giving in to smoking, drinking, drugs, alcohol, sex, whatever it may be. It's easy. It's hard that when those triggers come, when those challenges come, to sit with that challenge, to sit with that temptation, to sit with that trigger, and to say, no, it, it's going to pass. It's, it's going to pass. That's hard. It's really hard. It's easy to just get right into it. It's easy to just... Allow life to just happen. It's harder to plan your life. It's harder to set goals. Now, it's not a hard thing. It's just harder. Why do we make it so much harder? Because the natural man, the natural woman, we just want easy. We want the easy road out. It comes to, it's easy to, to be upset and to stay mad at somebody. It's much harder to say I'm sorry and to just try to and move forward. Much harder. It's easier to blame somebody else. It's harder to say, hey, I'm part of this. It's easier to say, oh, if they did this and they did that and they've done this, it's harder to say, you know what? I love you. Let's move forward. Let's forgive. Let's keep going. It's easier to tell my boss to, to get lost, to ignore anything they say. It's harder to do my best, to stay focused, to stay determined, to help them succeed. It's easier to let my yard go to waste and to not worry about trying to keep it clean, not to worry about anything with it. It's hard to keep it organized, clean, 
tidy. It's hard to take care of it like I need to. Life, we're going to have a lot of easy and hard things. But success, that challenge, comes at doing the hard things. And I'm not even talking physically hard things. I'm talking about those mental hard things, that those things that you've just got to push through. Those things when you walk into a room and there's somebody there that has offended you, that you swallow your pride and you just say, you know what? I'm done. I'm not going to do this anymore. I'm going to sit here. And when those triggers come, we accept them as they are and say, yep, that would be easy to really be mad or to really explode or to really take offense. But it's much harder to say, you know what? No. I value my life. I value my time. That, and I value my relationships more than I do the offense. It's easy to, to tell somebody to, you know, go shower. It's easy to, you know, go do, to tell anybody anything. It's harder to take action to do those things. It's easy to live off of our past. Oh, this happened to me, so now this is where I'm at. It's much harder to say, you know what? I am going to succeed in this life no matter what. I am going to make myself be the person that I know I can be. And that my higher power knows that I can be. It's easy to listen to somebody else and say, oh, this is what you should have done because, you know, it's going to help you. It's harder to do it. It's harder to do it. It's easy to be afraid of something, to, to want to run, to, to hide. It's hard to face those fears. I hope you realize that there's a lot of easy things. But if we really want to be who we want to be, and we really want to succeed in life, and we want to be happy, we want to find joy, we want to find a purpose in life, we must do the hard things. We must do those things that are not easy. Again, I am not talking about physical. Now, maybe you do have some of those physical things that you're facing that would be much harder from just a pure uh, ability standpoint. It's hard to face the mental. It's hard to face those challenges that are not physical and challenge tangible. You're amazing. You can do it. Rise up to the challenge. Face the fear. Face the challenges you've been given. You can do the hard things. Don't go the easy route. You've got this. You're amazing. Don't forget it. Have a wonderful day.